well, we are uh, as, a, as a lower. The card definitely is on uh, a winning course. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's not going to be like um, a second uh, round. We are determined to clinch the victory in the first round. And it's going to be a very convincing uh, victory because you already see the surge of the people and the mood countrywide. I think Kenyans want change and they will demonstrate this by voting overwhelmingly for the court coalition. This is uh, opinions of different people. So me, I, I really um, I won't put much on it because um, as you can see that um, they rated other issues which were not even discussed, like the economy was not even discussed. Yes, they are giving some scores and the ICC. So I, I really am not bothered by the, the, the ratings. I know that the best ratings is in the hearts of the people and they are going to, to show it. I am least worried about the so-called gains. Um, as you know that uh, sometimes they've been playing with the numbers, um, school statistics. Okay? I am more concerned about uh, public opinion, but opinions keep on going up and down. Even me, remember one time I was doing something, I came down to the 30s, now I'm somewhere there. We are now in the home stretch. And you are going to see this as we move on towards the, 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 the final, um, who is going to be the winner. I had the issue of integrity. And I think that uh, if we really want to reform this country, then we must really be concerned about integrity of the people that we are putting in the positions of responsibility. Otherwise, we're just going to be perpetuating the status quo. We received um, a report from the Police Oversight Commission that we felt that um, needed to be paid attention to. Uh, and that's the reason why I actually cautioned the President that wait a minute, we want reforms, but uh, according to this report, this is not really something that we should sweep under the carpet. But as I've said, you know, we are dealing with the status quo versus reformists. So um, uh, that is the challenge that we have right now.